Okay, it's been a while since I've done an updated video on the combo drive kit, the combination friction drive, chain drive kit. Uh, the kit is, it's not in production, it still is prototype, uh, but I just wanted to give you an update on it. Just a couple changes since last video. Instead of these slotted rear support bars, I just went with a fixed length, so it reduces any chance that the chain may slip down. Um, you see here, the chain is about a quarter inch from the tire, it's in nice alignment, it's, it's got the proper tension. Let's roll it back and forth here, see everything's spinning nicely, no noises or anything, so the kit really has been great over the last few years. Uh, we manufacture and sell friction drive kits, but truthfully, as well as they work, this just works so much better. So just wanted to give you a little demo, just going to take it for a little test ride. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it. Uh, again, this is a 52cc engine, so it's pretty powerful. Um, I'm about 225 pounds, so this, this moves me around nicely. If you went to the Honda GX35, um, you'd have to go to a larger sprocket, and that is another change that um, I did make. So let me move the camera around and show you that. Now the sprocket is, it's a third party sprocket, um, it's called the clamshell hub adapter um, and it just, it's 100% concentric so you don't have to waste your time with those other sprockets, the ones that are with the rag joint assembly that are attached to the spokes. This, is, this attaches directly to the hub and it's uh, again 100% concentric so it's perfectly in alignment. So that's uh, why the kit is working so well and, and also. So again, I'm just going to start it up and uh, give you a little test ride. I'm a 225-pound rider. Uh, this is about a two-horsepower engine listed as 52cc. If you did go to a smaller engine, uh, you'd have to go to a larger sprocket, which up to 60 tooth is available, so th that's really no problem. But between a, a 43 and 47, 49cc engine, about a 48 tooth, maybe 44 tooth sprocket should work fine with this particular gear ratio. Which here is, since this is a 1.75 inch pulley, this is a 5 inch pulley that works out to be a 2.875 to 1 gear ratio. 
And with this particular wheel size, 26 inch wheel, and the 48 tooth sprocket, it works perfect for this size engine. So again, you'll have to play with your sprocket size if, if you go to different wheel sizes and different power engines, but the kit has just been fantastic so far. Again, I, I don't write anything about this. Uh, thanks again for taking time to watch this video. So sorry it uh, took so long for the update.